Welcome back to the Collegiate Waterfowl Tour. Uh, we are here at the University of Montana. Uh, my name is Cooper Heaton and we are hunting today at Teller Wildlife Refuge with Grizz Ducks Unlimited. We're here to kick it off. We're gonna start off our morning. We are shooting a little slew right in the river and uh, we're cramming in a little blind. How are we feeling this morning? Cold. Yeah, great. Oh, good. Cold and tired Excited. and ready to shoot some ducks. Mm -hmm. No, we're gonna take Logan because the bed's already empty. Oh, perfect. Yeah. Uh, I'm Just gonna, make sure you I'm gonna wait leave now. my car at the end of there. Yeah. So, whenever you're all ready. We just drove the trucks out here at the blind. We're gonna take the trucks back and we're gonna come walk out here and get ready to kill some ducks today. I know I have bear spray in here somewhere. I just don't know where this yeah, is. There we go. Here. So, some hunters will tell you you don't need this because you're carrying a gun. I would prefer to have two methods to repel a bear rather than one. So, I always carry bear spray with me. Um, the catch with this is when it's below freezing, it won't always deploy. Um, but, better safe than sorry. Um, I also carry a 10 mil with me. But bear spray in the left hand, 10 mil in the right. That's the position I want to be in if I'm face to face with the grizzly. Um, hopefully I never have to do that. But I also don't want to be in a situation where I'm like, man, I really wish I had my bear spray. Uh, yeah, for sure. He usually doesn't know what's going on, so but what? man, he's happy about it. Wait, what's his name? It's Walker. The old Texas range. Mm -hmm. Good old boy. He's so happy. Oh. <laughs> you're not even wet. Why are you shaking? Go back. Come here. Oh, come here. Come. Go on. He won't listen to it. Such yeah. Such Wait, where's he from? Walker's Ireland. from Ireland. He's got an Irish accent. <laughs> look at you. Yeah, look at this thing. How about that? You can put him in the pit. I'd say in yeah, go for it. Okay. Right How many decoys drawn? Uh, we got 14, 6, and then 1. Are you going to run that many? Yeah. Okay. And a jerk ray? Yeah. I might not run the 6, we might just run 15 and a pulsator. If I can figure out. I let my decoys out to people. And I probably should store these a lot better than I did. So, this is very likely not going to work. Um, but I'm just kind of jimmy rigging a jerk rig. I bought these giant hex nuts at the hardware store, super cheap, paracord, um, and see how this works. Again, never done this before. Kind of a last minute effort, but I think it'll work. <laughs> I think honorary engineering degree is in my future, potentially. Not much wind going on, hopefully it picks up. It's like 35 degrees, a little storm front, hopefully might be moving in, so. What you got? That is the cool hat. You got that nice? That one's nice. Yeah, that's cool. You want it. No, I don't want it. Okay. Yeah. Got a hopefully we'll see a moose. Treasure chest. Too. That would be sweet. Yeah. One should come and say hi to her. No, that moose is a charging people. I'm good. <laughs> he can stay at a distance. Oh, I was gonna bring my binos and try and get him. But... 
thing's like 1,100 pounds. If we're gonna see it, we're gonna see it, Claire. They're elusive. They are, like, they're so quiet. They're sneaky. We were in the middle of nowhere and there was a cow. Pretty good. Good. Just feeling great. Feeling good. warm. Yeah, you're ready. Ready to finally get after it. Someone hears a honker, let me know. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think it's gonna happen, but I cannot hear honkers the same river. Uh, I lost him. Seconds, get your guns ready, get your guns ready. <laughs> Gonna be right up front. Shoot him, shoot him, shoot him, shoot him. Well, that happens. Barely saw it, dude. I couldn't even see that. Light up. Shoot him, shoot him, shoot him, shoot him, shoot him, shoot him, shoot him. Dude, big group behind, big group behind, big group. I Shooting guys. How do we feel about, we got a first dog. I'm so surprised. It was awesome. I can't believe I finally shot one. Accomplished my goal of the year. Congratulations. Hold on, hold it up. What you got? Uh, 
Good old Susie and Mallard. Congrats on the first duck, Aiden. We have the specialty breakfast. She's a camp chef. <laughs> I'm I'm just the mom. <laughs> breakfast. Okay. Extra toasty coming up. That'll be a good cream cheese thing. First up. Yeah, well, seeing how we went on mallards, I think everyone should shoot the gun. I, I, went, think, I went 0 for 3 on the mallards, too. I think I'm warmed up. Oh. I stood up on the mallards, or like on the end, and I, I missed. So good. Hit the spot. Pretty good. I love me a bagel. No props to the chef. Thank you, chef. Yeah, zero shout outs. <laughs> zero. Shout out to Claire. They love to hate me. <laughs> <laughs> yes, chef. <laughs> chef Claire, they're cooking up some fire bagels. Fire bagels. Claire, be I careful. Sleep. We're going to start calling you sleep. the chef. I now work the chat. like a dog. <laughs> oh my God. Just so y'all can eat. <laughs> Going to be out front, 10 seconds. From the right, from the right, get ready, get ready. Shoot him, shoot him, shoot him. Lie down! <laughs> we are not going to be jumping up today. Lie down. Nope. Wrapping up the hunt, didn't have the best success unfortunately today. Shot uh, three hen mallards out of uh, five of us, but duck hunting is duck hunting, it's all hunting, not killing. So we're wrapping up for our first little morning hunt here. Um, huge shout out to Teller Wildlife Refuge for hosting us today. They've always been a great resource for students at UM, giving us volunteer opportunities, uh, hands-on habitat and conservation work. Um, and so much more than that. Uh, also, thank you to Spondow Firearms and Ken Cartridges for sponsoring this video. Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe to the Campus Waterfowl YouTube channel.